Ho, oh, a friendly face. We don't see that too often out here. Lord Roth, have you come in search of lingering traces of the Sith Emperor? Oh, or yet another hidden scheme missed in the battle with Revan? Perish the thought. I only imagine that whatever business brought you here is of great import. I'm intrigued. Talo Strelik, at your service. Welcome to my humble expedition. I know what you're thinking. With all the turmoil of the last five years, why devote resources to something like this? Our interest isn't purely academic. Knowledge is power. And here lays the closest technological cousin of the Eternal Empire. The Temple of Sacrifice. A device intended to feed power to the Sith Emperor through offerings of the living. No longer functional after the fight with Revan. The temple was created by the Emperor's design, much like the Eternal Empire. I suspect there could be shared elements in the technology. We're working to exhume functional samples, but the Masasi make the work quite dangerous. They are ancient Sith bred into hulking warriors through the alchemy of Exar Kun himself. A wondrous anthropological find. Were they not so bloodthirsty? With your assistance, I think we could gather what we need before departing. Wouldn't take a day, even. That's the spirit. Here are the locations we should search. I'll be right behind you. Strange. There are pieces here that shouldn't be found together. Very strange. The time periods are completely at odds. Hmm. In any case, an investigation for another day. Let's continue with our present task. Centuries old. Sometimes I forget the kind of being our Sith Emperor really was. Without the Force, these mechanisms simply wouldn't function. Did you feel a shiver down your spine too? elements that don't belong. Hmm. Almost finished. I've identified one more sample to excavate. There. That should do it. We should return to camp before any of these pieces are damaged. Ah! I haven't been on an excavation quite this thrilling since my old master vanished. Never a dull moment when it comes to Sith archaeology, you know. You were a great help. These specimens should be more than enough to conduct the necessary tests. On the honor of the Drellic family, I'll find something worth pursuing. You've done so much for my research and asked nothing in return. I am in your debt. You're a colleague of Dr. Juvard Ogarob. Oh, that's wonderful news. I couldn't ask for a better engineering consultant. I'll begin preparations to depart the Yavin system forthwith. Exciting times lay ahead. Commander, I wanted to share my gratitude over your recent recruitment of Talos Drelic and commend your insight. In truth, we have sorely needed an individual more specialized in ancient knowledge and the more force-oriented technologies. Sadly, my genius lies elsewhere, and as these types of technologies form the foundation of so much within the Eternal Empire, it has been a consistent stumbling block for us. However, Dr. Drellick's insights have already started to break down these barriers to our progress, and I delight to imagine the inevitable breakthroughs that will soon follow. In fact, he was just speaking to me about the thesis for his doctorate, an in-depth analysis of an ancient race known as the Dishar. Fascinating work. Apparently, these creatures could siphon and consume force essence. Imagine what might result if the mechanisms behind this ability could be properly researched and understood. Could we create some sort of fixed or even portable biotechnological platform? Some sort of force dampening or consuming field? Or perhaps an explosive or warhead-like delivery platform. The 
possibilities. So myriad, it is dizzying. I... I must be alone with my thoughts. Such inspiration must be captured. This shouldn't take too long. I promise I won't let you down. The galaxy is stranger and far more dangerous than I'd ever dreamed. It's wonderful. The historical mind is ever curious and never sated. <laughs>